Amy, a visitation will be held today for former Titans kicker Rob Baronis. But as family and friends mourn his death, the investigation into what really happened before the deadly crash is getting a lot more complicated. News Channel 5's Cuthbert Langley has been following this story since it broke late Saturday night. And Cuthbert, we're hearing more 911 calls from that night that are disturbing. They are, Steve, and they are adding more and more confusion, raising more questions about what happened leading up to his death uh, late Saturday night. Now, one of the even more interesting phone calls actually comes from his wife, who reported him missing around 1140 Saturday night, some 40 minutes after he was already dead. Here's what we know so far about that night. Baronis uh, was driving, or excuse me, throughout the last few um, minutes of his death, there were several phone calls in saying that there were some road rage, road rage incidents. He was being violent towards them. And now you're looking at around 11 o'clock. That remains of his car right there. Really not much left. He crashed off of Battery Lane into a drainage culvert. And tow truck companies really had to work in overtime to pull out that car. Now his wife called around 1140, saying the last time she had seen him was either 940 or 1030. So the biggest question remaining this morning is why did he leave the home? He was watching a movie with his wife and her girlfriend when he disappeared. And the wife says that he just got up and left. He came home and <clears throat> we were watching a movie, and then he just left. No argument, no nothing. He just left. Okay. He was <clears throat> I had a girlfriend over, and then I turned around, and he was he was gone. Now the visitation is scheduled today here at the Woodlawn Funeral Home and then the funeral will be held tomorrow. So coming up in 30 minutes, we're getting more 911 phone calls from some witnesses who actually outline quite a frantic situation involving Bronus just 15 minutes before that deadly crash. You'll hear that tape coming up here in the next little bit. Reporting live this morning, I'm Cuthbert Langley, News Channel 5 HD. Cuthbert,